your eyes on the road and your hand off the horn, especially here in Florida, our state is number one for gun related road rage incidents. Fox 13 Shayla Reeves is live in Tampa to break down these uh, frightening numbers. Hey, Shayla. Yeah, good morning to you, Jen. More and more people are turning to guns to solve disagreements on the roadway. It's happening all around the country. The numbers are stacking up, and right now, Florida tops the list. Now, this is information coming to us from The Trace. It's an independent nonprofit news organization that took a look at data from the Gun Violence Archive. The review found road rage cases reported climbed nationwide between 2014 and 2016, with more cases reported in Florida. Than any other state. In fact, the numbers outpaced California and Texas. Road rage assaults more than doubled during the same time period as well. Now, here in the Bay Area, cases like these are getting a lot of attention. Police say road rage recently landed a USF football player in trouble with the law. In a separate case, deputies arrested a man accused of pointing a gun at a car carrying two children when the vehicle drifted into his lane. And last year, a brawl on the road between bikers and an SUV driver. Ended with a motorcyclist shot. Now, law enforcement agencies around the state are taking steps to make sure Florida roadways are safe for everyone. Safety campaigns and ticketing blitzes are some of the tools used by law enforcement to target aggressive driving before aggressive aggressive driving leads to violence. Right now, 1.7 million people in Florida have a valid license to carry a firearm or a concealed weapon. That number is up from 1.3. Million back in 2015. Reporting here in downtown Tampa, Shayla Reeves, Fox 13 News.